In today's user guide, we'll be taking a look at how to measure temperature with Pocket's multimeter function. So we've got two Pocket meters here today for our demonstration, but of course you can use Pocket Pro as well. And you can see they're connected here on the device's screen. So since we're ready to go, we'll press measure and select multimeter. And we'll want to put it into temperature mode. So press the mode button on the side and select temperature. So you can see the two different channels at the bottom here. So we've got the white one on the left and the yellow one on the right. So this one's already in temperature mode there. Now you can switch these between Celsius and Fahrenheit by pressing the button up the top here. You can also hold a value as well. So I'll just hold that temperature for however long it is selected for. So you can take that off there as well. You can also calibrate temperature if need be by pressing this cal button up the top here and then you can put in any value you like. Um, so you say if you had a separate temperature measuring device, you can match it up to that. We'll leave it as is for now. And if you wanna save a value, you can press that save button and that will save to history down here. You can press that I button and then you can see it there. Or you can save it and export it. Um, so you can save it to your phone or anywhere else you'd like or you can just straight up delete it as well. So since you've got two different channels, you can measure two different environments. So I might just take this yellow one away and then we'll put it in a colder environment and we'll see the two different measurements. So we just put this yellow pocket meter in the fridge for a while. So you can see it's starting to increase in temperature a little bit from the fridge temperature. But you can see that with this white meter, we've still got this ambient room temperature but then you've got this different reading in the yellow one. So you can measure two different environments at the same time, which is a really handy function. And again, we can save that and view it over here. And that's how to measure temperature with Pocket.